After receiving the RDB survival back from you guys a second time, I am still experiencing malfunctions. At this point in the video, I have put three 20 round magazines through it. So 60 rounds, I am on my third one, and then I experience an uncontrolled double fire. So with one pull of the trigger, two rounds are fired. Then I have a dead trigger. I clear the weapon. I put, a ma I put the magazine back in and the trigger is still dead. So then I clear it again and inspect. And I find that the hammer is no longer locking back. It is following the bolt home. With the hammer in the fired position, I can't even put the safety on. So I end up pulling the charging handle back, holding it in the rearward position and putting the safety on. Which actually ends up locking the, the hammer rearward. I then reinsert the magazine, charge the weapon, and you can see that I am very displeased because a round was just discharged as I charged the weapon. And you can clearly see that my hand was off the trigger. And now I will slow it down so that you can clearly see these malfunctions. First we can see that a single round is fired and then right here, two rounds fired with one pull of the trigger. Slow it down for you even more. There you go. And here it is discharging when I charge the weapon. Right there. At this point, it is clear that this weapon cannot be made safe. It cannot be repaired. I don't trust it, it's not reliable, and it is highly unsafe. At this point, I just ask that Keltec purchase the weapon back from me for what I paid for it, so I am not out the money that I spent on this, because I do not trust it and I don't believe that this can be made safe and it's not like I can sell it and recoup my money that way.